Also tonight, Austin Travis County medics have been through a lot since the pandemic began. A burnout led to staffing shortages that have been going on for months now. A newly signed one year contract includes higher wages for medics to help fix the issue, but shortages are still affecting coverage and response time. In fact, last weekend EMS had to move units to cover the UT football game and festivals that were happening around Austin. Here's KVU's Derenisha Heron. The first UT home game of the season brings an explosion of energy to keep up. Austin Travis County EMS had to make some tough calls. We moved some of the ambulances from the neighborhoods to cover UT um, because of the large number of people at UT and the likelihood of alcohol incidents and other types of incidents. The head of Austin EMS Union, Selena Shia, says that left at least two neighborhoods without adequate coverage on Saturday. She says one of the two units moved to the game was originally stationed in Northwest Austin while five other units sat because there were no EMTs to staff them. I have not been able to see what the response times were for this weekend, but I know it was really busy, and so I know that our response times were affected. She says the department is currently 20% short on staffing, an ongoing issue that she had hoped recent contract negotiations would fix. So our medics now start at $22 an hour. We were asking them to start at $27 an hour, which would make them competitive with the private market. That newly increased pay doesn't kick in until next month. She says to hire and retain medics, EMT pay and retirement benefits need to be in line with other local safety agencies. And we also know that the police dispatchers just got a really large raise and now they are making more than our medics. And while she doesn't expect future staffing shortages because of the planned events. But what I'm really concerned about is a wave of COVID or something else really knocking down our workforce. It will be a few years before this shortage is fully fixed. In Austin, I'm Derenisha Heron. Thanks, Derenisha. And the rising cost of living isn't helping the situation. As you heard, starting in October, starting pay for EMTs will go up to $22 an hour. That's up 18% compared to 2019. Now compare that to rental rates. According to real estate website Zumper, right now the average cost of a one bedroom apartment here in Austin is up 38% compared to 2019.